Hi everyone, welcome to another Nature Walks video. Um, I thought I'd just do a quick video on a plant that uh, you might be seeing at the moment. Um, this is the one. It's this purple flower down here. Now it's quite a common plant that you might be starting to see pop up either in any grasslands or sort of roadside verges or particularly where I am at the moment. I'm sort of in a big cleared area of meadow, scrubby meadow in the centre of my woods. Um, so what is this plant? Um, well it's quite a, a distinct one partly because it's got these very tall towers of flowers um, and if you have a quick look you'll see that each of the flowers sits above a pair of leaves that sit directly underneath. So you get this sort of pair of leaves, whirl of flowers, pair of leaves, whirl of flowers, pair of leaves, whirl of flowers, all the way up to the very top. And it's got a nice square stem, which is very common of the family that it belongs to, which is the mint family. So this is bugle. So this is bugle, very beautiful plant. But there is another one that's out now that looks very similar that you could confuse it with. And it's only over here. So just adjacent in this bit more sparse bit of grassland is ooh, ground ivy. So this is ground ivy here, which looks reasonably similar. So again, a tower of flowers going up with pairs of leaves sort of around the flowers. They're not quite in such strong levels as the previous one, but certainly uh, easy to mix those two up. So how do you tell the difference? Well, the easiest thing is I told you uh, the previous one was in the mint family. So is this one. So this one too has a square stem. Now square stem isn't unique to the family, but it's pretty a good indicator. So this is uh, another one of the mint family, but this one, if you rub the leaves, which are hairy by the way, so these have got a bit of hair to them, and you smell them, it's got a very, very strong smell of mint. If I go back to Bugle, which is just over here, and we have a look, you'll see that the leaves on this one are shiny, so they're relatively hairless. So when you sort of touch them, they're waxy. And if you give them a good rub and you smell, no real minty smell. Don't use the same fingers that you've just used before, otherwise they will smell of mint. But fresh fingers don't smell of mint whatsoever. So there you go, so there's two flowers, both purple towering stems uh, that you could mix up. There is a third that will come into flower probably in the next month or so called Self Heal. Um, it's not currently out, it looks very similar, but we'll, we'll have a look at that in another video. All right, bye.